we never mentioned, this is America through the eyes of two American Americans, this show. So, in, in America, we, we do things. We, um, we're known for many things. Um, musical genres, there's a couple genres that, there's a couple genres that we have, I'd say, created and that we lead the field in. We created them. Created, lead the field two, in. Two genres we created. We coined. We one coined would be, these genres. One would be country. Yeah, that's called hip hop. One would, who wants to go first? I have a gentleman by the name of Casey Donahue. He's 34 years old from Texas. He was really big on the rodeo scene before he started to, he followed his true calling, which was to write country lyrics. This song is called White Trash Story, Part Two. Oh. Are you familiar with part one? It's from his fourth studio album, Double Wide Dream. <laughs> I gotta get this trailer rolling downhill, because I'm sick of sitting here still. Grandma, she smoked all my swag. Dale Earnhardt three and the rebel flag. This trailer park is going straight to hell, but I'm still first class white trash, if you can't tell. Yeah, I, I can tell, dog. Yeah. Your grandmother smokes your weed, like, I can tell. Your dirt weed. Yeah. <laughs> now, Junior, he's a little slow. He got 18 months for the plants he grows. And Mary Lou's... Oh, this dude, I'm down with this fool. What's up? You like, I like this, this guy. guy. Mary Lou's back on the stripper pole to pay the bills. Oh, I'm in. I don't even know who this guy is. I love this guy. They got barefoot kids in cut-off jorts. <laughs> they spend every week down at Juvie Court for starting fights and selling grandma's pills. But wait a minute, I thought grandma was in a weed. Like, oh, grandma's on your weed, no. you steal her perks She's, and her okay. oxys. All right. Sarah Ann, she can't be found. I guess she got tired of being passed around. Oh, oh. hey, Ooh. it's your sister, dog. Some hood rat, some hood rat action in there. <laughs> hood rat down the country. Hood rat. <laughs> she planned a Waffle House wedding on the morning of a one night stand. I guess dynamite fishing was a big mistake. You know what that is? No, I mean... All right, so my dad used to do it. <laughs> it's not a thing. That's He's the... from Louisiana, so it, it's, I mean, people know what it is, but he didn't do it with dynamite, but they would do it with, like, homemade cherry bombs. But basically, if you're in any place where there's an abundance of fish and you, you drop toss a, it. a waterproof explosive it's... into the water, yeah. the fish basically have heart attacks, basically. and then they just float up to the wa top of I the got water em. dead, and you can just roll around and just yeah. pick up fish and throw them <laughs> in the boat. But, like, you can kill, like, 300 fish yeah. in, like, one thing and be, like... You can, like, slaughter, like, a whole... That's, that's like, uh, like Dick Cheney hunting from the... Uh, yeah. Like, just flying over, like... That's funny. That's um, a funny still thing. Like, hold on, I got a... Growing weed hold and on, dynamite yeah. fishing. Yeah, yeah. I guess dynamite fishing was the biggest mistake because my John boat stuck at the bottom of the lake. I don't know. And there's a pit bull chained to every tree with a cardboard sign that says, Pups are free. Oh great, boy. great, great. Rabid pit bulls yeah. running. Take Fighting one. Fighting rings. Take one. Blowing up fish. And... We like spotlight hunting and natural light. Oh, and the cops guy's... get called here every night. And there's a 12 gauge smoking from a woman who can take a punch. <laughs> Listen, I don't know. He's talking about several illegal activities yeah. in the song. I don't know if you're aware of this. I know, it's all, I know it's all cute and in a package with a little country western oh, song yeah, behind yeah. it. He's talking about like poaching deer yeah. and shit and like, like growing weed. And yeah, like punching women. Punching <laughs> women. Essentially. Yo Gotti, he's 30 years old, he's from Memphis. He's best known for his mixtapes. <laughs> never mind, never mind. Yeah. Fuck Memphis. Memphis! Oh, never mind, never mind. But I'm, they're not Memphis. Yeah. Sorry, my bad, my bad. Fuck Memphis. Never mind. Scratch that. I'll holler in another city. Um, <laughs> he's 30 years old, uh, best known for his mixtapes, Cocaine Music. Just released his first studio album this week, Live, live from the Kitchen. It's entitled. Mm. Thank you. The song's called Go Girl. Go Girl. Go Girl. <laughs> Top notch thoroughbred. A pro girl. Yep. I got this girl. She's so addictive. She call, she says she miss me. I tell her I'm a visit next time I'm in her city. I turn your world into gaudy world. Shorty, bring your ticket. Jimmy Choo and Red Bottoms. Shorty, we can kick it. I take her on trips. Her boyfriend be tripping. Oh. <laughs> takes, off, 
takes off on the menu, time machine, trying to hear it. What? I don't, I don't even know, know what that means. <laughs> Tattoos and piercings. Gucci shoes for children. Children, for the babies. Kids just you, as wait a minute, fresh wait, 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 wait. as sheepy. Hold on, hold on. You're, she's buying Gucci shoes for her babies. Yeah, because the saying. kids are just as fresh as sheepy. Oh, okay then. She's serious. <laughs> okay. So just for the record, tattoos and piercings, Gucci shoes for children. Kids just as fresh as she be, she's serious. All I do is ball, and all she fuck is winners. Take her to the mall, she didn't want to go to dinner. She a go girl, yeah. and I'm trying to get with her. Have her looking right, I had to follow her on Twitter. Had to. <laughs> oh, God. I she didn't want it, she didn't, she's not hungry. She wants to go shopping. Gucci shoes for cheering. <laughs> it's about time. I thought it was like an Asian, like I'm just cheering. <laughs> cheering out. <laughs> Super cheer. Uh, 